Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing just, I was going to say kind of like a haul. It is a haul video of the stuff that I've bought recently. I'm on vacation right now in Cabo San Lucas and I'm here with my family and I've gotten a couple things since I've been here at little markets and stuff like that. But then I also bought a couple pieces before I came, like especially for this trip. So if you're interested in seeing my new stuff, then just keep watching. All right, let's get into this. So the first thing I'll talk about, I guess, will be jewelry. And I've been really into earrings. I think that's kind of the big trend right now. So the first pair I have are these. They're just these really long and bold red earrings. I got these at Forever 21, I believe. The next two earrings I want to show you guys are from Target, and they look like this. This is the Target and Bobble Bar collection. So I just got this pink pair that looks like this, and then this white pair looks like this. These would be cute with this right now. But yeah, having a lot of fun with those. I think they're very summer and vacation resort style-esque, so I think that's very cool. The next piece I got is from Forever 21, and it's this huge choker. This was $20, which is... I don't know that I would normally pay that much for Forever 21 jewelry, but I thought this was such a statement piece and would be super fun with just a really simple tank top and like my hair up. So this is super cool and I feel like I call everything super cool. Like I watch my videos back and it's like cool, 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 but this is really rad. <laughs> I don't know, but it's a fun necklace and I know I will get some use out of that. So the next accessory that I got is actually this fish purse. I got this from Goodwill, which is super funny. I just, I don't know, I saw it and I couldn't not buy it if that makes sense because I knew I was coming here so I thought it was perfect um, but yeah it's got little seashells etched on it I just thought this was so funny and for five dollars why not this next thing is kind of goofy and I'm not proud that I bought this but it's a flower crown from forever 21 I just had a vision of this with a bathing suit that I have for the trip it's like rain I was gonna say very rainbow but it's just got all of these colors on it and i was like this matches perfectly but um yeah so i bought this we'll see if i actually wear it slash can make it look kind of cool but i don't know the next thing i bought is just this bandana uh, scarf it was from forever 21 but i liked that it was light pink and silky i thought this would be a really fun versatile piece for the summer just to style a bunch of different ways i don't know i find myself buying um bandanas and scarves and little turban headbands a lot because I think there's a lot you can do with them and they just really spice up any outfit. So moving on, uh, the one bathing suit I wanted to show you guys that I got is this one. This is the top of it. So this part goes around your neck like this and then you can kind of twist these and tie these around your boobs or however you like to do it. So it could go like that or like that and then you pull it out obviously. But I got this on Amazon for about $20 which is really cheap and a lot of Amazon clothing and bathing suits you have to be skeptical of because it's almost like the stuff that's made in china if it's cheap it's you're not going to get what the picture looks like if that makes sense but i made sure to read all the reviews for the ones that i bought and see pictures of different customers that have bought them and this one seemed to look pretty good and i've loved it no problem i will say this is a little bit fabricy. I don't have a big chest so if you had a bigger chest this might be a little bit better for you but i really like this bathing suit I bought in preparation for Mexico was this little set from Forever 21. It just comes with shorts that button in the front like this and then it has a matching button up short sleeve top. They almost look like pajamas. I don't think that they were sold as pajamas. I got them in store and they were around like regular clothing so I'm not sure. They look like pajamas though so they could easily be worn as such but I thought that was a really fun piece. I liked again the sleepwear element of it, but also the palm trees was perfect for Mexico. The next shirt I have is from Marshalls, and it looks like this. It's actually Ralph Lauren, which is super funny. I didn't know that he made uh, regular clothes, but someone just rang our doorbell. Uh, but this is from Denim and Supply Ralph Lauren, and it looks like this. It's just a long sleeve crop top, and it ties in the front kind of... I want to say Daisy Duke, but I don't think that's really the style of what it is. But this is just going to be really cute with some high-waisted shorts or like a white denim skirt would be really cute. Yeah, I like shirts like this just because I love wearing cropped things. And since this comes right under the boob, I think the long sleeve element makes it a little bit more conservative. This next piece is from Forever 21 as well, and it's just a black overall mini dress, which is really cute. I think this would look so good with the shirt I'm wearing right now. Um... Even with this, this would be cute. I thought this was just a really versatile piece and I wanna get more 
uh, overalls and like little dresses like this because there's so many different ways you can wear them. This was, I don't think I've been saying prices, but this was $20. And then the last piece as far as clothing goes is a little bit different. It's not gonna be everybody's favorite, but I love it. And it's this big yellow onesie sack romper. Uh, it's made out of cotton, I believe. Let me see if it says. It doesn't say, but I got this actually at a vintage store uh, in my city, and it's super fun. I think I paid like $40 for it, but it's just so cool. And whenever I see something like this that's just super different and I know could be worn a ton of ways, I I don't know. I always seem to end up getting them, but I thought this would be really cute as a beach cover-up or even just with a sports bra and some slides as like a casual outfit. So I thought this was super fun. Yellow has definitely been one of my favorite colors for the summer season. I've just been gravitating towards any gravitating I think I just I've just been gravitating towards anything that's super bright and fun as far as shoes go I have two pair well three pairs the first are these I got these at Marshall's and they are by Kenneth Cole I love this mule trend I said that in my spring favorites video but I really like these because they're neutral and go with everything they really elongate your legs and know, they're super comfy as well I'm such a baby about heels said that before so I love these the next shoe is from Marshalls as well, and they look like this. I'm sure you've seen a lot of styles like this, but these I got on sale for 24, and they wrap up your leg with this. But like I said, I've been into red too lately, so this will go perfect with those earrings. And I have a dress that I want to wear with this, so I'm sure you will see it on Instagram. So a pairing I've been loving are my Tommy slides and this Tommy bag. Both are from Marshalls. I shop at pretty much the same like four or five stores regularly, Marshalls, Forever 21, TJ Maxx, you get my point, but I love these together. I think this is a really sporty look, but also keeps it kind of put together with the name brand, and I don't know, it's just been super fun. Whenever I have these together, I feel like just a little bit more ready and done up, so I love these. This reminds me of the mini backpack trend, which I am not into, but I I like about other people, I just don't want to carry a mini backpack, I guess. So this kind of reminds me of the same sporty vibe that a backpack would. Okay, so moving on to the things I've gotten in Mexico. I'm so excited. The first thing I got uh, is just this fan. This is so cute. This was like $3, I think, out of, I don't know where I got this. I think a, a local shop around here. We're staying, we're in Cabo, and right next to our resort is this marina where a bunch of little vendors and, um, restaurants and all the water taxis and boats are and so I got this there I think it was like three dollars but I think this will just be super cute to hang on my wall uh, my room has a lot of neutral colors so got this fan the next thing I got is this ring bracelet uh, all-in-one kind of contraption this was I believe eight dollars maybe seven and it looks like this it's to be worn like that so I thought this would be really fun for the summertime and <laughs> I was even thinking like Halloween, but any kind of just different look, I thought this was a unique piece. So I just had this on, I had to take it off, but I also got this anklet. This was $3 from a local vendor. My mom is really big into anklets, so they always remind me of her, and she got one, so I wanted to get one too. I don't know, just super fun and very summertime. Today I went to a flea market, and it was just this big building full of... Uh, local vendors and different shops and stuff and um, we took a boat to get there it was super super cool but I got this bag there and it looks like this it's just a brown leather bag and it has some painted flowers on it super super cute just small on the inside I thought this would be good for going out and for the summer I don't know I don't have a lot of small bags so I thought this would be again good for when I go out with my friends then lastly, I got another bag. It looks like this. I thought this was super cute. I got this for $12, I believe. And then my last bag was $16. It looks like this, again, for going out. I like the embroidery on it. I thought that was super uh, trendy for right now, but even cooler just because it's from Mexico and was made here. And it's got the fringe. But yeah, just a nice casual bag that I'm excited to wear. All right, guys, that is it for my haul. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you soon. Bye.